since my lock picking video I was asked whether or not I can pick combination locks successfully. This is a model that I, I can pick successfully. Uh, it's a master lock. It is a computer or laptop retaining device and what it does is that little bit on the end there closes and locks onto your computer and that's how the device works and the current code is 3862 uh, if you can see in there 3862 so let's change the combination now the way you change this combination is by pressing that button turning the dials to the new comb combination remove the device and then you can scramble it so you press the button turn it to the new combination remove it and then that's your new code so let's do that but obviously so I don't know the combination I'm going to have to do it covered up so cover it up I am and then now I'm changing to the new com now I'm changing to the new combination hang on if I can yeah, I don't know what I'm just turning the dials here yeah don't need that spinning the dials and now we should have a lock and I do not know combination to as you can see it is not moving at all Now the way I've noticed that we do this one is that we push on the lock, create tension on the dials and then the, whichever is the stiffest dial you move it until you find the loose spot so let's just give that a go see how long it takes. I'll have to keep the camera running until it's done unfortunately because I don't want to put any cuts in it so here we go try and get that over that comfortably not easy. Here we are. Let's try that. Three feels good. And there we go. So the new combination was 3280. 3280. And there we are. Ooh, right. And there it is, open. So all I did, push down on the lock, whichever was the tightest, turned it until the dial was free. And there we are. Broken into. Well, maybe a minute, minute and a half, maybe. Just messing. So, yes, the answer is. I can break into these locks too.